clearing now. All right, let's get ducks out. Can I start slicing and going? Give them a couple of minutes to clear, and then we'll go. In the banqueting hall, most of the plates from the fish course have been cleared, but Tom can't begin serving until everyone's finished. Waiting expectantly for his main course is Richard Waller, the farmer who spent weeks rearing Tom's ducks. Hello, Tom. Hello, Richard. How are You're you? You're looking very stressed. So, we're a little bit under pressure, but I'm sure it'll all be fine. Well, I, all I can say to you is the first two courses were absolutely wonderful. Fantastic. So I'm now looking to you to really, really go to town on this one. Don't you worry, I won't let you down, Richard. I hope Tom would actually see sweat on the brow by now, so... But don't worry, it's about to start. <laughs> Top table. Pick the boards up from here, OK? Tom gets his marching orders and rallies the troops. OK, start going, Kenny. Start getting things ready. Lisa, you ready? We're starting to slice. The girls are going to come down to you that way, yeah? Right, OK, perfect. It's now a race against time to bring all the elements together and plate 100 piping hot dishes. Eight chop, lots of chips. Sam, come on, Chief, let's get on there. They're done, they're done. Kenny's doing it. Yeah, well, let's get them in copper pots. If Tom doesn't cook batches of chips at precisely the right time, he risks letting the duck slices go cold. Close the door, please. Timing is crucial if the duck breasts are to be served hot, so Tom's slicing them at the last possible moment before placing them on the warmed boards. Let's go, let's go. Come on, chaps, let's go, let's move. Let's go. OK, this one is for the Prince of Wales. Duchess of Cornwall, so let's make sure it's going. Follow them that way. They're going that way. Okay, way. So let's go, let's go. Come on, 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 come on. Ten minutes later than scheduled, Tom's first duck boards arrive in the banquet hall. But will they be a hit with the food producers? Enjoy your meal. Thank you. Damn you. Yeah, we can just be the same with the main course. It's absolutely fabulous. We've got duck, which is cooked absolutely beautiful. And then there's this little pot of, of stuff, which is uh, slow-cooked duck and mint and some mint shoots and some peas, which is absolutely beautiful. And then there's some chips to absolutely die for. Never had chips at a banquet before, but if they're going to be like this, I'd have them every day of the week. Although the first tables have been served, Tom's not out of the woods yet, desperate to serve the duck hot. He set up a production line around the kitchen. First, Tom adds the sliced duck. Next, Lisa adds a jug of gravy, as Kenny fills pots with the shredded duck, before Niall adds them to the boards and sends them on their way. Finally, everyone gets copper pots filled with the triple-cooked chips. Despite the military planning, it's taking Tom longer than he expected to plate up, and he's running behind. Come on, somebody else, let's go. Come on, Chief, let's move, let's move, let's move, let's move. Luckily for Tom, and in spite of the delay, it's going down well. Here we are. Really crispy. I like duck anyway, and the flavour in the skin, and, you know, the meat's so lovely and moist. It's just beautiful. Yeah, I really love that. June Newman provided many of the vegetables for the main course. So does she feel Tom's done justice to them? Duck and peas, classic combination. Oh, absolutely lovely. The mint, the peas, the little gems. The flavours just come together. I can't tell you how proud. Yeah, chuffed to bits. Finally, after the most intense service that Tom's ever done, his last boards leave the kitchen. Hey. Yeah. Well, Absolutely stunning, that, that, so right? Stunning.